With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, welcome to doubtnet. In this question, we have to find the solution set of inequality and the function is 1 by x minus 2 minus 1 by x less equal to 2 by x plus 2. This is the equation and the, the value of x is given as alpha, beta and gamma and delta term. Okay. Then this equation is 1 by x minus 2 minus 1 by x is less equal 2 by x plus 2. Okay. Taking LCM, then this is x into x minus 2 x minus x plus 2 less equal 2 by x plus 2. Okay. And x and x is cancel out and 2 and 2 is cancel out. Then we have 1 by x into x minus 2 less equal 1 by x plus 2. Okay. Then this equation can be also be written as 1 by x into x minus 2 minus of 1 by x plus 2 is less equal 0. And this is equal to x into x minus 2 x plus 2. And this is equal to x plus 2 minus x square plus 2x less equal 0. Okay. And this is equal to x square minus of x square plus 3x plus 2 on x into x minus 2 x plus 2 is less equal 0. Multiplying with minus 1, then this one is x square minus 3x minus 2 upon x into x minus 2 x plus 2 is greater or equal 0. Okay. Then this is the quadratic in x. Then the value of x is x minus 3 plus root 17 by 2 into x minus sorry x plus x minus 3 minus root 17 by 2 upon x into x minus 2 x plus 2 is greater or equal this equation is not defined x not equal to 0 not equal to 2 and not equal to minus 2 okay then when we plot on the number line then x is equal to minus 2 x is equal to 3 minus root 17 by 2 this is the value of 0 this is 2 and this is 3 minus root plus root 17 by 2 okay then this is positive negative positive negative positive and negative but we also have a greater than 0 okay then for greater than 0 this this interval this interval and this interval okay then this can be written as x belongs to minus 2 to 3 minus root 17 by 2. Okay. This is closed interval. This is open interval because x not defined for minus 2. Okay. Similarly, union 0 to open interval not defined at 0 and 2. Union 3 plus root 17 by 2 to infinity. This is closed interval, this is open interval. Okay. This is the value of x. Okay. And when we compare with the value of x, this is given in this question. And x belongs to minus alpha beta closed interval union gamma to alpha union closed interval delta delta to infinity okay and when we compare then we can write alpha is equal to 2 beta is equal to 3 minus root 17 by 2 and gamma is equal to 2 and delta is equal to 3 plus root 17 by 2. then in a first question we have to find the value of alpha plus beta plus gamma plus delta okay then alpha plus the value of alpha plus beta plus gamma plus delta and this value is equal to 2 plus 3 minus root 17 by 2 plus the gamma the value of the gamma is 0 okay 
then zero plus three minus root seventeen by eight, and this is equal to two plus three by two and three by two. Two plus three by two into two, okay, and minus root seventeen by two, and this is plus root seventeen by two. Okay, then this is cancel out. Then this is equal to zero, and this is equal to three plus two, and this is equal to five. Then we can write alpha plus beta plus gamma plus delta is equal to five. First option correct. In a second question given. Alpha into beta into gamma into delta. Okay. Alpha into beta into gamma into delta. Alpha into beta into gamma into delta. Okay, this is equal to four. But the gamma, the value of gamma is equal to zero. Then this is equal to zero. Then second option is incorrect. Okay. Third option is beta into delta. The value of beta is three minus root seventeen by two. Into three plus root seventeen by two, and this is equal to a minus b and a plus b, and this can be written as nine minus seventeen by four. Okay, and this is equal to minus eight by four, and this is equal to minus two. Okay, then beta into delta is equal to minus two. Then this is correct option, and this is correct option, and in a Last option, alpha, beta, gamma is equal to zero. Okay, then the value of alpha, beta, and gamma is equal to zero because the value of the gamma is zero. Then product of three is equal to zero. Then option D is correct. Okay, then we can say option A, option C, and option D is correct answer of this question. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.